Why is the sky blue while the sunset is red? To answer this question, let me show you a demonstration. A tub with milk solution is used in this demonstration. Milk is used as a scattering agent since it contains tiny globules of fats and proteins that can effectively scatter light like the dust particles and gases in the atmosphere. The activity should be performed in the dark to see clearly the beam of light. The white light here is used to simulate the sun, while the milk solution is the atmosphere. Notice that as the light passes through the solution, we can see that the color of the solution at the beginning is bluish and becomes reddish at the end. Remember that light is composed of the colors red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and violet. The short wavelength light waves like green, blue, and violet scatter more than the long wavelength light waves such as red, orange, and yellow. Thus, these short wavelength light waves including the blue, can no longer penetrate to the end of the top, since they are already scattered at a shorter distance from the light source. The blue color is more visible than the violet and green light because our eyes are more sensitive to blue. That's why our sky is blue, especially at noon or when the sun is directly overhead. Now, looking at the opposite end of the light source, the color is reddish-orange because the long wavelength waves are scattered less and are able to go through the thicker atmosphere. This is the reason why the sunset is red. The same thing will happen when using a drinking glass. The light is bluish at the top and becomes reddish at the bottom. The upper half represents the blue sky when the light moves through a thinner layer of gases at noon, while the lower half represents the sunset or even sunrise when the light travels through a thicker layer of gases since the sun is positioned at the horizon.